If you want to have to have a very active communication, you have to keep in consideration sounds, those sounds become words, those words they they have to express a sentence or sentences, and those sentences make speech. That's why the word is the main tool that allows man to interact with his fellow. It's the main tool that man can interact with his fellow. But word alone would not be enough to honor the value of the relationship between human beings. So the word is the main tool, but only the words are not enough. And then we see why. I put this image, which is a, a woman womb, and you see this woman has got a baby in uh, her womb. There are some hands around the womb, and there are some pictures as well, some drawing there. Why? Relationship is already felt in the embryonic state. So relationship between the person is felt in the embryonic state. So that's why I saw the, 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 the words are the main tools, but it's not enough. Because before the, the before the word, we have to build up relationship. A relationship is the first element that we human being get in touch. Even before that we get born. That's why the relationship is already felt in the mother's womb. If the relationship starts when the man is still not able to speak, then the ability to communicate is not just words. We could say that communication uses words, but words alone do not automatically produce a communication. And not necessarily create a relationship. So keep this in your mind. So we say that words are the main tool that allows men to interact with his family. But uh, communication uses words, but words alone are not automatically produced a communication. And that's why also, and not necessarily create a relationship. What are you? Are you studying us? Mute your mic. So keep this clear in your mind, brothers. How we make use of the word, but before making use of the word, we have to build up relationships. That's why I told you yesterday, we said that uh, the formator is to create a climate of trust. And the climate of trust and confidence is not made only by words. But uh, the important element that a formator has to do in the house of formation with formant is build up relationships. We need our words need our person, our existence, our interest. That's why I told that words enough don't produce automatically relationship. But those words, they need a person. They need our lifestyle, our existence, and also our interest for ours. 
word to become communication need our ability to relate with words to become communication need our ability capacity to relate with someone there are people they are very good in writing books excellent but at the time of communicating they are zero that's why for a formator needs to learn how to relate with words we have two kinds of words said words and no said words those who are expressed and those who are not expressed those words, they make a language. So they produce a language, verbal language, with the same words and non-verbal language, with no same words. But also, even though they are not expressed, they are not saying, we are communicating. So that's why also it's really important for us as formators to know how to communicate, making use of verbal language and non-verbal language. And sometimes, brothers, the non-verbal language is more genuine than the verbal one. You know why? Because uh, the verbal one make use of our voice and sounds. 